Hey guys, thanks so much for watching. Today we are doing a home goods haul slash home decor tour. At the end of this, I'm going to show you where I'm putting everything, what I plan on doing with it, and all that good stuff. And I'm always doing something different around here. As you guys know, I'm never like satisfied. I always want to redo a room or just like put some more stuff somewhere, shift it around. And so I have a lot of really, really good stuff to share with you. The only thing with home goods is they don't have an online store. I wish they did. I'm sure we all do. So I will link as many things as I can. If I can't find the exact item, I will link a dupe. And yeah, if you are new to my channel, welcome. I'm so glad you decided to stop by today. Please subscribe before you go and hit the like button if you guys love home goods as much as I do. And let's get started. I know I'm sitting a little bit far away, but I just wanted to make sure I could show you guys everything in the frame. So the very first thing, I have these already. A lot of you have probably seen them in the kitchen. These were $9.99 for the bundle, which I think is a really good deal. I actually saw these when I was checking out and I was like, I need those because I've been looking for a second one for the longest time. I've always been planning on bulking that one up and I have those in my office right now. A lot of these things are for my office because I'm going to be redoing that room and I am so excited. We're going to talk about that a lot at the end of this video and I'm going to show you guys what it looks like right now and what I plan on doing, but that is going to go in there. And the next thing, I love this, first of all, it's so pretty. It has a Ted Baker sort of feel to it, but it's not Ted Baker. And this was $19.99, it's by Bandeau. And I don't really know what to call this. It's kind of like an organizer of sorts, like it has a pocket, it has slots for pens, slots for cards, um, slots for like a sheet of paper and just like smaller items. And I just think this is going to be so handy for me. Like everything that I need, I can just put in here. And the look of it is so me. I'm sure you guys will agree that it's just like the pretty floral and that pink color. I have a lot of this pink on like the thumbnails on my videos and stuff. So I saw this and I was just like, that is literally perfect for me. I think it's going to look so pretty sitting on my new desk. And just everything about this, I was like so, so excited. And then I picked up this box. This was $14.99, I guess I'll call it a box. I don't really know like what to call it, but I just thought it was really pretty. It's like very simplistic, but it still feels fun. It has a bamboo style handle and a gold color. And then I believe this is called like an ostrich leather, like faux ostrich leather. I'm not positive though. And I did have a purse that was like this a few years ago in a lavender color and I loved it. So I guess my style really hasn't evolved that much. It's probably not a good thing, but I don't know. I just really liked this, especially for the price. I thought we could put it like on a console table in the dining room or on the coffee table with the remotes in it or in my office. I don't know. It's just something that could go like pretty much all over the house and it was a really good deal. And a few more work and office related things. So this is the second time I purchased a full month spread like this. This is only $5.99, $6.00. And I just think these are so pretty. You guys, I have been dying to film this video so I could unwrap this because I want to use it so bad. But I really like this one, how it has the polka dots and then the pink color, like a very similar shade of pink to this guy. And I like that it doesn't say the month, so I can write in the month, I can write in the days of the month, and then it has a section for next month and a note section. If you guys are planner people, I know so many of you guys are. HomeGoods always has a bunch of different kinds of planners and like a bunch of different price price points and I have seen the Lily Pulitzer planners there a million times those will price I think they're $40 or $42 I know I've seen them for at least half that so yeah if you are an organization person definitely check out home goods because they always have so many different things and the next guy I am really excited about this it's like my favorite thing in this video just because I know I'm going to get so much use out of it so this is actually like a magazine holder, but I'm going to use this for my laptop and my charger because it's always all over the house. Like it's on the couch, on the dining room table, on the kitchen counter, it's always in the way. And so is the charger, I trip over it literally like every day and it's so frustrating but i know if i put it in a drawer i'll just never put it away because i always like want it out i'm always just like flipping it open and checking something and then putting it away kind of thing so yeah i really really like this it was 30 dollars. i don't think that's like the best price in the whole world but since i'm going to use it every day i went for it it did come in a bunch of different sizes this was the largest one but there were probably like four or five size options and the hardware has a rosy hue to it just this was like so me again, like the first thing I showed you guys, so I had to get it. And then I did get two of these floor pillows and I showed these in my home goods shop with me from like a month ago. I will put a card up here if you guys have not seen it. 
and I didn't purchase them then, but I saw them at another Home Goods, and I like was still thinking about them. So I'm like, okay, it's a sign. I need to get them, and I just think they're so pretty. I have a few more floor pillows coming, so I'm going to like probably stack them like every other, and I will show that to you guys when they're here. But I just think they're so pretty. I I don't know. I feel like literally everything I'm showing you guys is like pink and white. But for me, pink is like a neutral color at this point. I hope you guys. It looks like super bright in the camera, so there we go. I hope you guys can like see the color okay, but it is like a very light pink. It is velvet. I love the square. I love that they have a handle on them. These were twenty dollars each, I believe. Or no, these were twenty. $4.99, so 25 bucks. I think that's a pretty good deal. Floor pillows do tend to get really expensive, but $25 I was more than happy with. And these are a little bit random, but we have been looking for this style of cup for lattes for a long time now. And I don't know if the name brand is the Nespresso brand or like what it is, but there's a really popular see-through mug essentially that is like this and they are for lattes and I think it's $40 for a set of two which I'm not about to spend $40 for two like see-through mugs so this was 10 for a set of two and we have so many lattes as a lot of you guys know I'm always talking about that and this is just like perfect for that it's exactly what I was looking for but for a fourth of the price so that was a great find too and these last two things I'm just going to share these real quick because I did a um, fall home decor video I will put a card up here if you haven't seen it and I shared these in that video I realized I still have the tag on this but I showed those I showed these on the dresser in our bedroom on the smaller dresser because that's where they're going home goods just always has so many really cute picture frames for a great deal this doesn't have the price tag on it anymore but i'm pretty sure this was like seven or eight dollars so i love 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 that if you guys seriously if you need smaller frames like that definitely have a look at home goods and then i buy a ton of fake flowers there as you know this one was 16.99 and it's white i have been really trying to make a conscious effort to stay very neutral in our bedroom because i'm just a pop of color person like i love fun things but in our bedroom i want it to be simplistic so that it just feels really relaxing so this was perfect for there for less than 20 dollars. i just think that's really cute and just perfect for that space all right guys, so the very first thing are these flowers. I did put them in with the ones that I already had and there are going to be a lot of things that are changing in this room. We're gonna talk about that in just a second. I did put this right here for now, just on top of this guy because the handles are very similar. And I don't really love that this is see-through on top. I mean, it is fairly messy. I need to reorganize that, but still like, I don't know, I just think they look pretty cute together and I like that it kind of hides some of the openness right there. And I have shown this space before. This is the opposite side of what I just showed you guys. So this is my workspace, but this is going to be changing completely and I'm really, really excited about it. So I did put these things right here, but here is like the first one I showed you, or that I told you guys about that I purchased from Home Goods, the Work It Girl one. This is the one that's going to go on my new desk and then this is going to go like with my laptop wherever I'm working that's gonna have everything I need on hand and basically I want to put these shelves over here in this corner and all of this stuff's going to come off the wall and then I want to do a circular rug right here and I don't know what size this is when I bought I think it's an 8 by no it's not an 8 by 10 I think it's like a 6 by 9 or something random but I mean, I put it in this room and as soon as I bought it, I realized like the shape is just not the right size for this room. So I'm going to get a circular rug and a new desk, like a see-through desk and put it in the middle of the room. And I have been seeing so many curtains that I liked, but I wanted to wait to buy new curtains until I had a rug because obviously the rug is more important than the curtains. So that's why they still are the ones that are too short. And yeah, this is like a little bit of a mess on this side, but I've been meaning to get a basket for products that I want to share with you guys and talk about in videos and just like packages that I get um, from brands and things like that. So for now, I've just been like throwing everything in this corner, but eventually there will be a basket that goes on one of the bottom shelves that goes over here when I put it in this corner. So yeah, I know that was kind of like a lot to throw on you guys. Hopefully you kind of followed that, but I do love this desk, but I'm just ready for something new, a new look in here, and I don't know, I think it's like really pretty, but 
I just want the circular rug and a see-through desk and just like a really chic style. And then on this wall, I'm going to get a calendar. I think it's acrylic and it has like four... Um, I'm going to put a picture of it on the screen because I don't know why I'm having such a hard time explaining it, but that's going to go on this wall with some wall art. And then in a video next week, I'm going to share a new bench with you guys. It's going to go right here. So yeah, I'm really excited to redo this room and share it with you guys along the way. And here's where the magazine holder slash laptop holder is going. So I just think it's so perfect that like I can pick it up and move it around and it just looks so cute on an angle right there. I'm not really showing you guys that rug because it's coming in an upcoming video. But I just think something like that is such a great idea. Hopefully that will help a lot of you guys out if you have a laptop too and you don't know where to put it. Like... I don't know, I just feel like that's so practical and so cute looking right next to this couch. And lastly are those floor pillows. I don't know if I should get a basket to put them in, like a larger one, way larger than that obviously, or if I should just see how it looks with the four stacked up. Let me know what you guys think. And that's it for today's video, guys. As always, thank you so much for spending the time with me. I really do appreciate each and every one of you. If you are new to my channel, please subscribe. I'm such a hand talker, I know, but I like literally cannot help it. Please like if you guys did enjoy this. Everything will be down below, recent videos, products I featured, and I will see you right here in a few days in a brand new video. Bye.